Alright, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, Mom's Goose Gaming and welcome to some Call of Duty news. In this video, we'll be going over all the recent leaks that we got regarding Call of Duty 2021 and let me tell you, they are very very exciting if they indeed come true. And anytime if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to see for the like button, first in Call of Duty, make sure to subscribe, turn on the notification bell and join the notification squad. Without further ado, let's get right into it. It is very important to keep this one thing in mind and that is everything we talk about in this video are only rumors. They are not 100% confirmed by Activision, no. While yes, they do come from trusted sources who have leaked information regarding Call of Duty before they were even revealed still it is only rumors and with rumors you always gotta take them with a grain of salt okay so what is exactly going on well let me tell you a couple of days ago a Twitter user by the name of Victor underscore Z ended up posting this image that you guys are seeing on your screen right now of a sledgehammer and a Call of Duty World War 2 image now if we put one and one together the sledgehammer of course represents the gaming developers sledgehammer games and the image of Call of Duty World War 2 represents the era and the setting of the next Call of Duty now this is quite interesting why you might ask because about a month or so ago we ended up another liquor gun call of duty 2021 and it said that this was going to be developed by sledgehammer games and it's going to be a world war 3 setting do you guys see some sort of a pattern here we had multiple leaks of gun call of duty 2021 and they both suggest that sledgehammer games will be the next developers but wait there's one more pattern that we see here and that is the world war setting in the previous leak it said it was going to be world war 3 and now in this new leak by victor underscore z is saying it's going to be a world war 2 setting so two things are pretty much unofficially confirmed and that is the developers and the setting now whether it's the future setting or the past setting of a world war but we know it's gonna be something relating to a world war but wait we already have an answer to the question of is it gonna be a past world war or a future world war because another twitter user by the name of hb and 21.3k others ended up replying to that post by victor z saying world war 3 question mark and then victor ended up replying to him again saying world war 2 so that wasn't a typo or a mistake by victor because he is confirming that it's gonna be world war 2 whatever his sources are they are sure that it's gonna be world war 2 if you guys remember it was only about three four years ago where we ended up getting a Call of Duty set in the World War 2 and guess what it was made by Sledgehammer Games. Now the campaign of Cod World War 2 focused on the major events of World War 2 but as you guys know World War 2 is not just a couple major events it's a lot of events so if it is indeed a World War 2 setting then they have a lot of other areas to explore other missions to give us that we did not see back in Call of Duty World War 2. But hold on because after all it might just not be an exact World War 2 setting. What I mean by that is another Call of Duty leaker a very trusted Call of Duty leaker who has leaked a lot about Modern Warfare, Black Ops Cold War, War zone so he has trusted sources that know about call of duty and are posting this on twitter saying if code 2021 isn't set in the future i think we're getting and then he has a picture of a gorilla and then modern warfare you combine that together gorilla warfare okay after that charlie intel a very very great source for all your call of duty news i will have a link to all of these guys twitter in the description down below and are posting on twitter saying that next call of duty will be set in the mid to late 1950s but hold on there's even more proof because okami another call of duty leaker a very trusted leaker as well ended up saying the same thing Call of Duty 2021 will be set in the mid to late 1950s. Now let's do some quick maths here. Charlie Intel Okami said 1950s and then Tom Henderson ended up giving us a picture of Gorilla and Warfare. Of course Gorilla Warfare, it makes sense. Gorilla Warfare was used in the Vietnam and the Korean War. When did the Vietnam and the Korean War take place? Mid to late 1950s. You see? If you guys have been a long time fans of Call of Duty you would know the 1950s has never been visited before. The Korean War has never been visited before. While yes we have visited Vietnam before in Call of Duty games but nothing major. However there is just a slight problem because three people ended up saying it's gonna be in 1950s while one person is saying it's gonna be World War 2. Now if you guys know your history World War 2 did not happen in the 50s by the 50s World War 2 was already finished World War 2 spanned from 1939 all the way to 1945 and here we're talking about 1950s so where did World War 2 come from we are not quite sure unless it's gonna be a multiverse of some sort but then again what is this Marvel Universe? <laughs> Like I said, this is the only conflicting part about all this leaks because three people are saying 1950s and then one person is very very sure that it's gonna be World War II. So what is exactly going on here? We are not quite sure. But I'll tell you what, this is sounding really really interesting. And in terms of the leaks, this is it. Now I wanna give you guys my opinion about what I think about this and I would love to hear your guys' opinion about what you would like to see as well. Make sure to comment in the section down below. First of all, I am all for exploring new settings, new areas where we haven't been before and the 1950s would do just that. So in terms of that, I am very very excited. However, when it comes to revisiting history they are limited with what they can do they cannot exactly change history and say this happened when it didn't so they will be pretty much recounting everything that happened it will be true events while yes that's good for the information but then again look at call of duty world war 2 they recounted the true events of the horror that was world war 2 but they were very limited with what they can do weapons maps they couldn't do anything crazy they had to stick with real life weapons and real life locations otherwise the game would have been historically inaccurate and people would have not been happy and like i said that got really really boring real quick but not only that we just got 
a past Call of Duty game in Black Ops Cold War, of course set in the 1980s, the Cold War and all that. So I think having another past Call of Duty is not going to be a very very good idea. Something set in the modern time or even a near future, maximum of 10 years, nothing more. I think that would be amazing. Modern Warfare did absolutely wonders with the COD community because not only it had nostalgia, it was also modern time and they could do whatever they want with the storyline. They weren't stuck with real life events, they could go as crazy as they want and that's what makes it absolutely absolutely amazing. The only Call of Duty that was set in the past and told true events while still adding a bit of their own was Call of Duty Black Ops 1 and let me tell you that is one of the best games ever made but if Sledgehammer games can do that where they recount true events while still adding a bit of their own like Black Ops 1 I'm all for that I think that would be absolutely absolutely beautiful. But like I told you guys this is my opinion and this is what I think about these recent leaks I would love to hear what you guys think so make sure to comment the section down below. And if everything goes well we shouldn't be waiting much longer a month month and a half at most I would say before we get actual and confirmed teasers regarding Call of Duty 2021 and I'm gonna tell you guys I cannot wait. But with that being said thank you guys for watching this video if you want to watch my previous one make sure to click the video on the screen right now and if you guys are excited for call of duty 2021 make sure to see for the like button for everything call of duty make sure to subscribe turn on notification bell and join the notification squad and i'll catch you guys later